welcome back to the Lamenter's Redemption Part 3. With 7% Penitent, we are going to attempt to carry on uh, reuniting and reclaiming the Lamenters to their former glory. So, huh? There we go, Mouse had a little bit of a fit. Right, I f can't remember what we were doing. I think we were going to patrol the southern sector. Uh, look for Tyranids or something like that, and then oh, there is Tyranids there. New Tanif. You know what? We might go down. There is a bit of an Orc menace up in the north, but the Tyranids shouldn't be allowed to spread. We'll go and engage the Tyranids, and then we'll cross back up and engage the southern flank of this Orc threat. All right, Lamenters. Oh, end of turn. Let us begin. Second. Excellent. Neghada. Nothing. Valhia. Nothing. Excellent. Let's carry on our crusade for Imperial space. Ooh, artifact. No one around. I recommend we send in a, just a quick recon team to go pick it up. Alright, ooh, there's a psychic hood. Okay. And those marines have been brought back, I assume. Good. Librarian. Servo arms. Inquisition, Ecclesiarchy, Priorus. Yeah. Power Armor. Will be identified in four turns. Ah, we'll just let it identify by natural. It'll take us four turns to get to the turners anyway. Shadrach. Necron Tomb, we'll have to keep an eye on that. Fell. The Fell system. With the Imperial Fist Retribution Fleet could've, should've, and would've annihilated the Iron Warriors had they not stupidly obeyed Rogal Dawn's orders to automatically return to Terra. They should've stayed and fought, but oh well. Okay. Necro... New Tanathon, Necron... Oh. Dead Planet makes sense. Uh, Psychic Hood. Run a normal tube plate. That is unshearable. Oh, cool. Well, I might give that to a librarian at some point. Actually, our chief librarian. What's he armed with? Um. One power nine. You know what? We're going to give this to him. He identified it. He should. He should be able to use it. HQ. Ma apothecary, apothecary. Chief Librarian. Equip. There we go. Chief Librarian has a new psychic hood. I think that's a good investment for him. On the blast side, when we eventually get off this penitent, we're going to have a good amount of uh, requisition to buy new ships and supplies with, which will also be very good. It is a pity that this day and age so many of the Imperial citizens die, so many Imperial worlds unpopulated. Mm. The loss of the civilian population saddens me. And we will show them our wrath and bomb them into dust. We are going to keep we're going to bomb these guys down and then attack. Because I'm not dumb enough to... Uh, cool. Extreme good. We're slowly going to just beat them down with orbital attacks. Because the Lamenters may be honorable and fight in noble combat, but they're also not stupid. And I'm not going to fight for a world that's just a blasted rock and waste valuable Lamenter lives when there are no civilians or anything on the planet. Uh, 
bombard. I want to get them down to at least moderate. And it still says the turn is a heavy. I'm going to select all and attack. I want to see what this is about. Oh, shit. Okay. Uh, enemy force is 92%. No, oh, we lost the rhinos and land speeders. Come on. Enemy forces bolters, storm bolt conversion pima. Uh, heavy flamers, storm bolters. Lyra folk, dreadnought close combat weapons, storm bolters. Ooh. Good, librarians are doing a good thing. Rending claws, bot pistols. Whew, we didn't lose any lives. That was a good thing. Uh, had a couple of vehicle damages, but thankfully the tech marines are there to repair it. For those we cherish, we die in glory. Such an awesome battle cry. Alright. And the Tyranids have been wiped clean from this planet. Uh, just to double check, really. More than anything else, we're just going to land the Marines on a planet and do a final scouting run. Excellent. Chapter found nothing. Victory for the Imperium. Alright, the Mentors. Let's go. Alright, Loki. Interesting. Actually, how much would is it to purchase new ships? 2,000 for Gladius and 2,000 for Hunters. 8,000 for Strike Cruisers, 20,000 for a Battle Barge. A new Strike Cruiser. I've got 3,000 up there. A new Strike Cruiser might be a good investment in the future. To replace the ones the bastard Minotaur stole from us. May they forever burn in the warp. Ooh, crap. Necron Tomb. Nowhere. Beautiful. Who named that one? <laughs> That's just dumb. Who named it? Just checking the surrounding Imperial places. No Turinids about. Right, we're gonna go to nowhere. Engage this turned threat. And the Inquisition are going to discover. Alright. Uh, turned presence heavy, ancient ruins, turned presence heavy, turned presence moderate. We need to beat down the heavy ones so they don't reinforce the moderate planet. And then we can slowly be piece them down one at a time. Not going to bring the Luden along. But four captains, four champions. This is this will be good. Oh, no, this is not good. Shit, I should have should have played this out better. Oh no, we're still doing all right. Okay, we didn't lose any marines. We just lost a few a few uh, vehicles keep worrying because I'm so paranoid about the the lament is easy fragility and my own aggressive play style which means I've got to damn it greater demon of Nurgle which means I've got to actually fight and protect the civilians which means I keep doing stupid things like launching attacks and suicidal defenses that I shouldn't I lost one lexicanum marines critically injured six marines lost one. One of them was Alexicanum. Okay. Whew. That's not too bad. Uh, who is wounded? Okay. Let's go to the Armamentarium. And we need to purchase a bunch of load of bionics. Uh, 20. That'll do. Nefarium, Psychic Hood, Iron Halos, Plasma Bombs, Exterminator, Scout Armor. Cool. Right. 
Let's have a look for any wounded. None of the first company are wounded. Well, they are the best of the best. Oh! Oh, these guys. Okay. Um, whew, these guys are not looking too good. Uh, add bionics. Excellent. Tactical Marine Patrick. Interesting names in the future. Ooh, no. Uh, the auto select thing sometimes is kind of annoying. I don't actually think I have enough bionics for this, believe it or not. Yeah. <laughs> Just going up to the armamentorium and going, Hello, do you have five billion pairs of bionics? That should do. Bionics are not a, a permanent solution, they're just a, a quick fix if you need to carry on the fight. Devastators? What wound did the devast- oh, like the enemy attacks in the rear. I see, okay. They're working on more chainswords though, as long with other weapons, so I don't understand why they're getting their asses handed to them, but no, oh well, maybe they're just not as effective in close combat as I thought. Mikhail. Mikhail. Such a cool name. Alright. End turn. Right. Uh, sparse, sparse, moderate. Moderate. Excluding the wounded. All in attack. Pretty I don't have any predators or land raiders. For those we cherish, we die in glory. Look at that. Fifty-six storm bolters open up, forty-four storm bolters open up, eight bolters, underslung bolters, ladders, cannons, the chief librarian is doing an amazing job with his new psychic hood. Ooh, bolt pistols, conversion beamers. Good. Right. Um, what else have we got? In attack. I'm worried about those ancient ruins. They don't seem right. I might send a company in there, maybe. We'll see. Enemy forces defeated. Alright. The Inquisition cannot doubt my skill at this rate and my fighting ability. I mean. I am going around saving the Imperium and doing it one planet at a time. Oh, greater demon of Nurgle. <sighs> we lose. It's sad that we lose so many librarians this way. When I get full recruits back, I'm going to up open up the librarian training. Open up the librarian training, I should say. Alright, uh, ancient ruins. Right. And you, my friend, will add bionics to. Along with you two. Right, select all. Unload. Explore the ruins. Knew that was going to happen. What have we got? 150 cultist marines. Huh. <laughs> okay. Brilliant. Nice. The Inquisition finishes inspecting my ship. Good. Uh, disposition 1528. Did this mechanicus. Okay. Alright, what's the next planet attack? Well, the orcs are really whoa. That forge world is about to become toast. Emperor, protect the civilians on that planet. We will do what we must. We need to attack the southern flank of this orc empire, uh, taking out as many foes as we can. Is there any other forge worlds in the area? Yes, so I can still grab new supplies from them. 
All right. We shall carry on. We're not going to lose out this day. Penitence 126. Penitence will be gained slowly over time. It is pretty slow. Forces are expected at Pavonis 24 turns from now. Um, where is Pavonis? Pavonis, Pavonis. Now I doubt I can actually get any Marines there at this time. 24 turns. Let's see, if I go straight out, that'll get 34 turns. And it's disappointing. But sometimes it's the price of it. I mean, I'd very much like to go on this crusade. I would consider that a good idea. I'm going to take the STC fragment. And we are going to identify it myself. Ooh, enhanced armory. What does that mean? Chain expert. Doesn't look like I've got any new things I can build or make. I don't actually know what that means. Oh, vehicles. Oops. My bad. Predator tank. Oh, interesting. New bikes. Land speeders. Whirlwinds. Oh, I wonder... Oh, target first company. Oh, okay. So these are all vehicles... Oh, I honestly never noticed that. Which is probably really sad. Alright, we're going to get three Predator tanks. And another Whirlwind. And... And we will... Begin our assault on these Orcs. Bloody green skins. They're a threat to the Imperium and must be stopped. Fear for that planet. Okay, orc, orc presence. Heavy. Uh, moderate, moderate, moderate. Maybe if we chip around the, the side, then if we chip away, then we might be able to get a bit more on them. Good. 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 Alright. This is a bit. Where are my predator tanks at? Oh, predator, predator, predator. Can you re equip these? Oh, you can. Okay, hold on. What can you re equip? Nothing, okay, but you can have two. Whoa. Take away. You can, oh, you can equip it with assault cannons and stuff for better weapons. Interesting. Okay. Cancel that. But, can I re-equip these? I wonder if I can. Oh, without Dreadnought Terminator armor. Apologies, audience. I just... I want to see if I can do this. Tap 2, tap 1. Like, could I make a Razorback if I threw a last cannon on it? No, appears not. Oh, well. Right. Attack. By the Emperor's name, we attack. For those we cherish, we die in glory. Excellent. Excellente. All presents tiny. Good. We're going to slowly chip away at this orc threat. Moderate, heavy, tiny. Alright. I think it's... 
Actually, maybe it isn't quite time. Armamentarium. I can easily produce more vehicles, can't I? Why not? Just grab ourselves a few more vehicles. And... Then we shall attack. I know it may not seem like much, but just having a few extra predators and whirlwinds and stuff might actually help. Enemy forces 89%, 99%. Okay, we lost the two predators I just immediately purchased. Beautiful. Dread and Battle Wagon will be destroyed. My last three predators have lost. Enemy forces 56%. Enemy forces 51%. They've broken through my vehicle cordon. Plasma guns, whirlwinds, close combat weapons, and heavy flamers. Alright, orcs have gone down to two. Alright. Sparse, moderate, moderate. Attack the moderate forces. Oh no, still got five predators. It just seems like they have good armor, or my tech marines are very well trained in their job. Nearly there. If we, once we liberate this system, I will call this a part. This is going to be a long series, by the way, guys, because I am very much determined to get that to 100%. Well, obviously, I need to... Uh, need to take down this system, but first, I'm going to have to go back and save Fergax. But we concentrate on one battle at a time. Alright. For those we cherish, we die in glory. Excellent. Enemy forces defeated. Excellent. The Yeti system has been overrun by orcs. Ugh. This orc empire up here is disgusting. It needs to be stopped. Where is the Imperial Navy? Pfft. Doing bugger all as usual. I really wish there were some NPC uh, chapters just in this slot, these slots here. Like four NPC chapters that would help out. I don't know. Make them completely random, random names like Bloodhammers, you know, successors of Robo of the Ultramarines, Rabute Gellerman, or like, I don't know, and just have them show up, basically do what the Imperial Navy does, show up to a planet, fight all the enemies on it, and then leave again. Maybe they'll have a home world, maybe they'll be fleet based. The home world ones, they could maybe, their home world could come under attack, and you could help save them, and if you do, then they'll owe you like a debt and they'll give you like artifacts or something. I mean, that would be awesome. I mean, I'd do that. Defend this, defend a fellow uh, chapter's homeworld. That'd be great. Kind of like how the, what the Astral Cause did to the Executioners. Uh, Astral Cause saved the Executioners' homeworld and the executioners gave them a relic and owed them a blood debt for it. Which I consider pretty awesome. Right, to finish off the video, we'll go clear out those ruins. Fourth company. Fourth company is still on nowhere. I was wondering why I was fighting my battles with fewer marines than earlier. I am still an incompetent idiot sometimes, I must admit. Right, well, new mission is to go save Fergax, go back, retrieve for Third Company, then go to Oren's World. I'll have to write myself a mental note to keep an eye on that, because I'll, I'll no doubt forget that Third Company is there by when I do the next part of this video next week. But in the meantime, First Company, you're up. Lictor, go clear out these ruins. Explore the ruins. Wait, hidden fortified laboratory. Uh, 
Uh, this is a moral choice and a half. It could be traitor. It could be loyalist. No, we can't. We're going to salvage it for requisition. And we're not going to touch it. I don't know whose gene seed it is or where it's been. It was better that we just destroy it. It could have been the gene seed of a loyalist chapter, but it could have been the gene seed of a traitor. That's actually a new one. Never encountered that before. Very good little moral choice. Well done. Alright then, well, thank you everyone for watching. If you're wondering why my energy isn't so high, it's because it's actually about 10.30 at night. And I forgot to film this earlier, instead spent the time uh, watching Brooklyn Nine-Nine. So apologies about that. And hopefully I'll see you again next time. Hopefully we can get that up to 20%. Hopefully we can reclaim third company. Hopefully we can fight the orcs. We'll see. Bye guys.